Cool, so we've ducked into the, is this the Botanical Gardens? Yeah, right? the Botanical Gardens. That's With right. Alex from... From Sprint Law. Sprint Law. Um, and just behind is where? So what, it's this, that's where all the law firms are? Yeah, this is the, the centre of Sydney, the CBD. Um, yeah. For sure. But, and where's the cool place to be? Because I've chosen like the grandparents' place to come for a walk. For right? sure. So I look at this as, as the place that we're trying to disrupt. So no, we're, <laughs> okay. we're actually based in Chippendale and Sydney. What do Sprint Law do? Like your 30 second, 20 second? The 30 second pitch, yeah. Um, so we're a, a new sort of law firm for startups and small businesses. And we've tried to really reinvent the law firm model to make legal services more accessible, affordable, um, and, and quicker for startups and small businesses. And so you're dealing with a lot of startups. So a lot of our audience, I'm pretty pretty close to the startup scene, not just legal in London. What are the kind of challenges here, or what's the ecosystem like? So you're in a space with a load of startups that are presumably not not many law. No, there's a, are there law firms there or lawyers? Or? Yeah, there's a few. Um, but yeah, I think the, the, the real sort of challenge is, so I mean, I think in Australia we're having a little bit of a startup revolution. Maybe we're a few years behind the rest of the world, but there's a lot of new companies, particularly I guess started by sort of younger yeah. tech generation. And so for them, it's really just navigating the legal system and, and understanding all the complex things that are involved in their disruptive business models. And how do you guys help with that? I think for us, it's, it's really just been about working out how do we simplify things for them? Uh, how do we communicate in a way that doesn't use jargon? Yeah. both in terms of our documents and the way we speak and, and work with them. Uh, you know, lawyers are traditionally quite formal. The profession is, is a very formal profession. Yeah. And when you've got companies that their whole business model is about rejecting the sort of old way of doing things, um, they, there's really this sort of jarring experience for them uh, in, in status quo. So for us, it's been about speaking and thinking more like them and, and making our services feel a lot more like the services that they're providing. I like that, um, cutting out the jargon. How's that been? Like you've got a team of eight, right? Um, yeah, how many right. of them are lawyers? Yeah, so half of them are lawyers and, and the other half sort of focus on, on sales, marketing and communication. And, and that's really important for us as well. Yeah. yeah, I think. And with those lawyers, how hard is it to get them culturally to, are they, um, to cut, cut the jargon? Like how much yeah. challenge is that? Great question. And I think it is, it is a natural sort of instinct, particularly all of our lawyers are quite well trained a lot of them at sort of big law firms so it, it, it is a challenge to sort of get them to write things differently explain things differently um, for us it's just been about having some sort of basic rules you know no long emails um, you know no no legal jargon yeah. uh, we have some guidance on the way that we sort of write things and the way that we do things and rolling them out and, and giving feedback I guess to, to our lawyers has really helped with that process but they really sort of get the mission you know they're on the phone directly with the clients and they're, they're going to feel it if they're using too much jargon when the client says, I don't understand what you're talking about. So sure. I think that really helps as well. Super interesting, Alex. Uh, we've got the event uh, tomorrow that you're coming to. Um, what's the best way to connect? I can put a link in. What's your URL? What's the best way? For sure, yeah. Sprintlaw.com.au. Our website's probably the best way to find us. And, and so I'll about. pop a link in the description below um, so anyone can check it out. Uh, and we'll hope, hopefully we can get you over to the conference in October. Sounds awesome. Cool, thanks.